Rev your engines. Understanding idioms in English. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today we're diving into a fascinating English phrase, rev your engines. This expression is more than just words. It's a burst of energy and excitement. Whether you're a car enthusiast or simply curious about English idioms, you're in the right place to learn about this dynamic phrase. First, let's break it down. Rev is short for rev up, meaning to increase the running speed of an engine by pressing on the accelerator. Engines, as you might know, are the heart of vehicles, powering them to move. So, when someone says, rev your engines, they're literally talking about making an engine run faster. Imagine sitting in a car, pressing the pedal, and hearing the engine roar to life. That's revving. Now, let's shift gears. Beyond the literal, rev your engines, is a popular idiom. It means to get ready, prepare for action, or build excitement. It's often used to motivate or energize people. Similar to saying, get ready to go, or prepare for action. Picture a racetrack, where drivers rev their engines before the race starts. It's all about building anticipation and readiness. Understanding is easier with examples, so let's explore a few. One, before a competition, a coach might say, rev your engines, team. It's time to show what we're made of. Two, in a meeting, before launching a new project, a leader could motivate their team by saying, let's rev our engines and tackle this challenge head on. Three, personal motivation. When setting personal goals, you might tell yourself, it's time to rev my engine and chase those dreams. These examples show that rev your engines is versatile, fitting into various scenarios where encouragement and motivation are needed. So, that's the essence of rev your engines, a phrase that's not just about speed and cars, but also about igniting the spirit of readiness and enthusiasm. Whether you're on a literal or metaphorical track, this idiom reminds us to prepare, get excited, and accelerate towards our goals. Thank you for joining in today's linguistic journey, and I hope you're feeling revved up to use this energetic expression in your conversations.